Hello everybody, and welcome back to Terminator Resistance. And we're going to go ahead and get back into this. After the last video, I really, really like this game. Um, mainly it's gameplay. I still feel it's, um, voice acting is a bit lackluster at some portions. I mean, yeah, but I mean, I'm not too worried about that. I'm enjoying the game. But that gameplay with the Terminators, I really like that. I really like that a lot, actually. Plasma weapons can be upgraded with Skynet chips. Okay, I don't have a plasma weapon. Okay. Um, here we go. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Let's just let them by. It's as scary as a Terminator from the movie. <laughs> Um, but the, the thing we faced earlier, it was a Terminator, I think it was like one from the newest Terminator movie, where it can like, shape, shift into anything, but also it did spark, and the one from the new movie does not spark. Um, okay, so I failed at that. I'm gonna try it again. I think I had the right idea. I guess I need to charge my phone. Garsh, garsh dong, gar, garsh dong it, garsh dong it. Hold on, put phone down, back to game. By me, go go that away. Okay. 
Okay. Be a bit more stealthy. Whoop. Okay, so there's a group of four coming that way. Where are they going? Oh, please don't come by me. Please go around to the right. Oh, yes. Around to the right, baby. Around to the right. They're going, like, all the way down. So I can't be zoomed in and do it, right? Okay. That's terrifying. Can I head through this? No, I'm not gonna head through this door. Can I go around this door? Um, guys, we probably should get out of here. Okay. Seems like we're good. Seems like we're good for now. Okay, so Commander Barris is a she. It's good to know. Never want to get your genders wrong. Ooh, Howling Wind is never good. There's something off. Okay, no, never mind. Just leave the area. <laughs> so just finally over the soldiers I rescued from that old university hospital. We'll deliver the message to Commander Baron that I need to meet with her. The only thing left to do is to do now is wait. Is to wait. Not is wait, is to wait. You got a grammar. Just because we live in a world where Terminators rule and roam about does not mean there's any less reason to have proper grammar. <laughs> grammar is everything, don't you know? Ev ev everything. Okay. Where is everybody? Oh, thank God, you're finally here. How did it go? Did you find the soldiers? Yes. I did. I helped them escape from that hospital. Yep. You don't give up on your people, do you? I like that. So what now? We wait for Commander They're Bears. supposed to come for me soon. Great. That means that you're going home? No more scavengers constantly nagging you to do things for them? I'm okay with that. I bet you like the sound of that. Oh, Erin's still up too. Go talk to her. She won't admit it, but she was just as worried as I was. Do you need help with anything? Is that your best pickup line? Sorry, that was a bad joke. I I tend to do that when I'm stressed. I think I got it from my dad. Better that than his mustache, right? Oh, I'm sorry, don't mind me. Seems you were very close. As close as could be. He taught me everything I know. Sometimes without me even knowing. 
This one time, when I was little, he wanted to make a huge sign that said, Welcome, on the side of our house in Pasadena. So he said, I bet you can't spell that. <laughs> and of course I had to prove him wrong. Believe me, now I know how stupid that was. Not at all. That was very clever. Yeah, he was always full of bright ideas. Thanks for trying to make me feel better. After Judgment Day, my dad turned our house into a safe haven. A home for everyone who lost theirs. We were like a family with an endless supply of uncles and aunts. I guess my father wanted to help with the war. We never really used guns. So the only thing we could do was to help others in need. Seems like he helped a lot of people. He did. Right till the very end. Anyway, it was actually really cool. Everybody loved him, and he loved having them around. I think it's because he always had a brand new audience to listen to his bad jokes. He had this really terrible one. He'd walk into the room and ask if anyone had seen his remote because his team was playing. <laughs> I always laughed at it. I'll never understand why. Sounds like a champion of dad jokes. He may have coined the term. I was begging for him not to find a whoopee cushion on a scavenger hunt. He'd literally get a heart attack from the excitement. Look at me yapping. I'm sorry, you probably have enough on your plate. Anyway, thanks. It's really nice to have someone to talk to. You got it. No no big deal. No big dealio. Okay, I'm gonna head on down. Here you go. No need to worry. I'm fine. <sighs> Who said I was worried? I've been thinking a lot about it. And if I can, I've decided to join the resistance. I'll do more good there than here. Mm, I'm glad to hear that. Nice. I just hope you're better supplied over there than we are. Speaking of which, I see you've got those antibiotics I asked for. Yep. Good. Now I can call Ryan off. I asked him if he brought a shovel with him. If you think that was too morbid, <laughs> he said that after Judgment Day, digging graves was one of the few things he actually got better at. That's good. Oh, that is so adorable. I wanna, wanna... I want a screenshot, it's so adorable. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I'm gonna share it. So adorable. Sorry. So adorable. Okay, well in that case. Let's go ahead and rest, shall we? Few days later. Jacob, come upstairs. There's someone here to see you. Ooh, boop, 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 boop. Oh. They just removed the kid, but it's still adorable. Oh. <laughs> I just removed the kid, but it's fine. I'm gonna share it anyway. Good luck out there. I shall try. That is for sure. Okay, not much. Um. Oh, I had stuff in there, and it removed them all. My backpack is full. Can I move any over? <laughs> Don't mind me. I'll leave you guys with all of this stuff. Those sound things. 
are quite dumb in my opinion. They don't really work. It's not an alien isolation-esque thing. Okay, well here we go. Let's meet them. Hello. Private Rivers. Hello. Yes, sir. I've got a message from South Division's Field Commander Baron. She's okay. agreed to meet with you. She set up a rendezvous point at the unfinished metro station. You'll need to enter the canal system under the bridge. The meeting's supposed got to it. take place tomorrow, so I suggest moving out soon. Understood. And Rivers. Because of what you did for our guys at that hospital, I'll give you a heads up about Commander Baron. Don't expect mm. a warm welcome. Okay. Well, looks like you're leaving us soon. Yep. Aaron wants to join me. What about you? What do you think about enlisting? Me? <laughs> no. I still have hope I'll get that bus running again. Also, nice. I don't like the attention oh. Skynet's given you guys. I'd rather stay as far from the line of fire as possible. Patrick, get back here! You better go see what's going on. Is everything all right? Patrick's decided that he wants to be a scavenger. And now he won't come out, even though I'm worried sick he'll get stuck. Get back here right now, Patrick! But there's lots of cool stuff in here. You told me it's our job to find stuff for the group. Your sister is right. Get back here. It's too dangerous. Oh, all right, all right. I'm coming out. What was that all about just now? I've got a meeting with Commander Baron. I'm leaving soon. Sorry about that. You probably heard my okay. phone ring. I'm going with you. And don't even try to stop me. Are you sure? Okay. What What's about matter? Patrick? Don't they let you boys bring dates? Don't worry, kids. She's just worried about you. But she never lets me do anything. That's what older siblings do. They look out for us. Was your brother like that too? Well, not really. Mm. Anyway. Let us go. Out, 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 and away we go. Gain the ability to mark your enemies with weapon aim by upgrading your stealth skill. Shotguns can stun terminators for a short period of time. Good to know, actually. Okay, so shotguns are do have some effectiveness against them. You can shoot them and stun them long enough to get away, but it won't do damage. You need a plasma type weapon to do any sort of damage to them. Those turrets. That was very effective. The one didn't do much against that one but then the other one killed like three or four of them so effective <laughs> effective immediately I still cannot wait for Doom Eternal I'm trying to figure out if I should play by myself if I should record my reaction to it I don't know looks like we got here know. first oh is everything all right you seem a little out of it <sighs> sorry I probably shouldn't zone out like that with a gun in my hands, huh? No. Am I making you nervous? <laughs> no, not really. Well, you should be. I don't have any formal training like you. I never even held a gun until recently. Can I be honest with you? Uh, sure. There's a reason I decided to come here with you. I want to meet Commander Baron myself. They're here. Oh, okay. okay. When I heard that Private Rivers of the non-existent Pacific Division wants no needs to have a meeting with me, I thought, oh, what a lucky girl I am. But then I started thinking, who is Private Rivers? And why should I treat him as anything other than the deserter he is? So right now I'm hoping you give me a good reason why I shouldn't just skip the court-martial and execute you where you stand. This is bullshit. And who do we have here? A brave scavenger. Rivers, do you always bring unauthorized civilians to fight your battles for you? 
We would have got to you sooner if you hadn't pulled out all your troops from Pasadena. People died there because of you! And what did you do about it? Did you pick up a gun and fight back? Or did you run like you sewer rats always do? Ouch. Stay out of this, Jennifer. This doesn't concern you. Yeah. Today is all about private rivers. Okay. So what can you tell me that I don't know already? Um... A few weeks ago, the outpost I was stationed at was ambushed by a Terminator, I think. It was half man, half machine. The entire Pacific Division was wiped out by a single enemy. Half man, half machine? What are you talking about? How did your men let an enemy get that close to you? And we didn't know it was a machine. Mm. It could walk, talk, bleed, sweat. There was no way to distinguish it as an enemy. It infiltrated us perfectly. This infiltrator, is it still alive? I I'm not sure. Okay, for now keep everything to yourself. I don't want any this, <laughs> especially since you only think you saw something. Okay. Skynet's coming. We're not done here yet, Rivers. Take this plasma. You're a resistance soldier. Time to act like one. Ooh. To your positions! Drones! Up there! Fire at will! Oh, this is this is the weapon I like. Take cover! Don't be shy, Rivers! This is a great time to attack! I think I got one! Okay. More will come. We need to move. Quiet. Get that door open. What the fuck? Fall back. Fall back. Language. Open that door. Terminators. I can finally do damage to them. Hasta la vista, baby. Oh gosh. Saving. Okay, in that case... I'm gonna end this video here, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye!